Hello everyone, welcome again. Let us explore an L1 project today. It goes by the website agnes.ai. So Agnes basically is a layer one blockchain ecosystem, which is uh, claiming to be an AI driven decentralized ecosystem. So when we talk about number of uh, the applications that data has or that AI has, that is actually tremendous in terms of blockchain because eventually blockchain is nothing but just a data management system. Although with other things like distributed ledger technique and other things, blockchain work a lot of things, but artificial intelligence actually has a lot of applications and we consider blockchain because of the immense amount of data approval mechanisms and other things that blockchain is actually handling and that is where Agnes can actually make a difference. So let us explore what Agnes AI is all about. It is basically an AI driven decentralization that is what Agnes claims it to be. It is about speed, trust and innovation. Those are the keywords or the buzzwords for this particular website. We talk about the prime features. So it focuses itself around scalability, trust, speed and speed especially no fraud, which has been the case with a number of blockchains, number of projects these days. So almost all the projects are focusing these days on how to make it more secure, more fraud proof and more scam proof. That is what Agnes is also focusing on in this project. If we talk about the technology, I mean, this layer one is EVM compatible, which makes it, I mean, interchangeable, it's compatible across multiple platforms. It has got a hybrid consensus mechanism. So which is, I mean, a good thing. So let us move ahead from just the basics of consensus mechanisms, which have been happening over the time. And this makes it hybrid consensus, which is like even better a step further gives the speed to the blockchain approval mechanism and actually more say, compatibility to various uh, mechanisms when we talk about especially the blockchain it is ai empowered so when we talk about the ai empowerment here it is like it, it says that intelligent safeguards in every transactions seamlessly intertwined with security and innovation so decentralized ecosystem is basically something in which a number of interoperable say elements interact with each other and that is where the artificial intelligence just plays a key part and they can actually make something happen in this case if we talk about the use case of this particular thing so when we talk about the real world potential transparency goes by one thing traceability um, of course it is like inherent to the blockchain fraud reduction is one thing smart contract automation and enforcement this is one thing that most of the blockchains are doing so that has to be an inherent feature they claim it to be efficient of course it has to be efficient with the hybrid approval mechanisms and cost saving and quality assurance are the few features that Agnes AI holds in its body. So when we talk about the dApps, basically there are a number of things that Agnes AI is focusing on, data security being one. Tokenization, if we talk about, so for in-app transactions and then incentives, uh, tokenization can be implemented. Interoperability, of course, is there. Peer-to-peer, -peer, direct and secure transactions can be ensured and enabled using the Agnes AI uh, layer one blockchain and the community governance, of course, it has to be a part of the dApps. So these are the things, but the most important feature that I can say see in this is the scalability aspect. So when you talk about the scalable project, it has to be reaching certain level because without a mass scale adoption and a scalability options, I mean, a true Web3 project is difficult to survive. So that is one important aspect of this particular uh, project, which actually excites me and actually leads me to think positive about the project few things which i mean we can term as authenticity verifications which can be done so blockchain certificates are there so you can search your certificates on blockchains for credentials and authenticity anti-counterfeiting can be done the tokens can be authenticated there are like smart labels so you can use like your own make your own qrs you can make your own smart labels to work on this particular project and the trust of the consumer so a number of new things number of features which are embedded into one to make the project a more user friendly and say a kind of one-stop shop in many respects so that is the that are the key features of this particular blockchain project that has come to the roadmap so quarter two and three of 2023 have already seen the foundation and the quarter four has already seen the development and prototyping now when we talk about quarter one and quarter two of 2024 which is the current year they are already on testnet testnet deployment will be a one thing that they will be targeting and about that after the testnet is deployed the optimization and feedback by quarter three we can see the mainnet launch and the growth of ecosystem and we can definitely say by quarter i mean 2025 first quarter and beyond that there will be a lot of things happening and developing in this project so all in all the roadmap seem like a reasonable estimate of how the project can be deployed and how 
how the project will be moving across and seems like an interesting project with us. So if you want to know more about Agnes AI, Agnes blockchain, then you definitely can go there. But the key feature that I would again like to point out here is the AI day one decentralization, which is the key feature. So a lot of projects coming up with AI uh, ecosystem in the blockchain world. That is one thing. Agnes also has its own say in this and some features of Agnes actually set it apart from the rest of the projects which are coming up. One important thing about the project, the testnet for the project is already live and uh, they seem to be progressing well with the technology. And another thing that the project will be going for hackathons which will further strengthen the technological base and will invite more projects to be run on this project. So this is something that is inviting and we can see and look forward to a number of more things from Agnes in the times to come. So we wish all the luck to the Agnes team for their progress, their growth and can see that in the times to come, Agnes is definitely going to make a mark. With that, thank you so much for being with CoinCubber and we keep bringing more projects in the times to come. Thank you.